GOP lawmakers continuing their push today for students' safe return to the classroom with money that they approved last year. Republicans argue that states have only spent about $5 billion of that $70 billion that Congress allocated in past COVID-19 relief bills. However, President Biden's relief plan calls for an additional $130 billion to help schools fund new ventilation systems, personal protective equipment purchases, and widespread testing. However, Republicans say the aid package doesn't require the funding to be spent immediately for these pandemic-related expenses. 95% uh, of the money that they put toward education wouldn't be spent until after 2021. In other words, 2022 through uh, 2028. Uh, hardly seems like an emergency if you're not, uh, if you're not uh, be able to get the money out there quickly. A White House spokesperson addressed the issue. The funding laid out for future years is to help districts help students catch up academically and also to provide protection for high poverty level schools like facing budget cuts from state governments.